Assalamu alaikum. In this video, we will talk about how to find the derivative of trigonometric function. What is the derivative of y is equal to sin x? There is a function y is equal to sin x. We will use the definition of derivative to find the derivative of this function. By first principle of differentiation, d by dx f of x is equal to limit del x tends to 0 f x plus del x minus f of x over delta x. By using this formula, we obtain the result dy by dx is equal to limit del x tends to 0 sin x plus del x minus sin x over delta x. Now we will use the formula of trigonometric identity sin a minus sin b is equal to 2 cos a plus b by 2 sin a minus b by 2 taking a is equal to x plus del x b is equal to x so put the value of a and b in this trigonometric identity we get dy by dx is equal to limit del x tends to 0 2 cos 2x plus del x over 2 sin del x by 2 over delta x. Now simplifying dy by dx is equal to limit del x tends to 0 cos 2x plus del x by 2 limit del x tends to 0 sin del x by 2 over del x by 2. By applying limit dy by dx is equal to cos 2x plus 0 over 2, 2 to cancel cos of x and the next term limit del x tends to 0 sin del x by 2 over del x by 2 is equal to 1 by using the result limit theta tends to 0 sin theta by theta is equal to 1. So dy by dx is equal to cos x. So the derivative of sin of x is equal to cos x. Next what is the derivative of y is equal to cos x. To prove this result we will use the definition of derivative to find the derivative of this function. So by first principle of differentiation d by dx f of x is equal to limit del x tends to 0 f x plus del x minus f of x over del x. Now by using this result we can write dy by dx is equal to limit del x tends to 0 cos x plus del x minus cos x over delta x. Now by using the trigonometric identity cos a minus cos b is equal to minus 2 sin a plus b divided 2 sin a minus b by 2. Taking a is equal to x plus del x and b is equal to x. So put the value of a and b in this trigonometric identity we get the result dy by dx is equal to minus limit del x tends to 0 2 sin 2x plus del x by 2 sin del x by 2 over delta x by simplifying dy by dx is equal to minus limit del x tends to 0 sin 2x plus del x by 2 limit del x tends to 0 sin del x by 2 over del x by 2. Now applying the limit dy by dx is equal to minus sin 2x plus del x which is equal to 0. So tx by 2, 2 to cancel minus sin of x and the next term limit del x tends to 0 sin del x by 2 over del x by 2 is equal to 1 by using the result limit theta tends to 0 sin theta by theta is equal to 1 so dy by dx is equal to minus sin x so the derivative of cos of x is equal to minus sin x next what is the derivative of y is equal to tangent x to prove this result, we will use the definition of derivative to find the derivative of this function. 
so by first principle of differentiation d by dx f of x is equal to limit del x tends to 0 f x plus del x minus f x over delta x by using this result we can write dy by dx is equal to limit del x tends to 0 tangent of x plus del x minus tangent x over delta x so dy by dx is equal to limit del x tends to 0 tangent x plus del x we can write sin x plus del x over cos x plus del x minus tangent x minus sin x by cos x over delta x by simplifying this result we can write dy by dx is equal to limit del x tends to 0 1 over delta x taking the LCM of this two term so the LCM of this two term is cos x plus del x cos x so sin x plus del x cos x minus cos x plus del x dot sin x now by using the trigonometric identity sin a minus b is equal to sin a cos b minus cos a sin b taking a is equal to x plus del x and b is equal to x so putting the value of a and b in this trigonometric identity we obtain dy by dx is equal to limit del x tends to 0 sin a minus b sin a x plus del x minus b minus x over delta x dot cos x plus del x cos x here plus x minus x they will get cancel so dy by dx is equal to limit del x tends to 0 sin del x by del x limit del x tends to 0 on our cos x plus del x cos x by applying limit limit del x tends to 0 sin del x by del x is equal to 1 by using the result limit theta tends to 0 sin theta by theta is equal to 1 so dy by dx is equal to 1 1 over cos x plus del x x plus 0 cos of x cos x multiplied cos x is equal to cos square x now secant x which is equal to 1 over cos x then secant square x which is equal to 1 over cos square x so dy by dx is equal to secant square x the derivative of tangent x is equal to secant square x again what is the derivative of y is equal to tangent x we can also prove this result by another method so we can write y is equal to sin x by cos x here sin x is the numerator and cos x the denominator by using the quotient rule according to the quotient rule denominator and then take the derivative of numerator minus numerator and then take the, take the derivative of denominator over denominator whole square so dy by dx is equal to cos x d by dx of numerator sin x then minus numerator sin x d by dx of denominator which is cos of x over cos square x dy by dx is equal to cos x as it is derivative of sin x is equal to cos x minus sin x as it is and derivative of cos x which is minus sin x over cos square x so dy by dx is equal to cos x multiplied cos x cos square x minus into minus plus sin x multiplied sin x sin square x over cos square x as we know that cos square x plus sin square x is equal to 1 so dy by dx is equal to 1 over cos square x is secant x is equal to 1 over cos x then secant square x is equal to 1 over cos square x so we can write dy by dx is equal to secant square x 
so the derivative of tangent x is equal to secant square x through the following derivative d by dx cotangent x is equal to minus cosecant square x d by dx secant x is equal to secant x tangent x also d by dx cosecant x is equal to minus cosecant x cotangent x these are the trigonometric function sin derivative of sin f of x which is equal to cos f of x and again take the derivative of function which is f of x similarly derivative of cos f of x is equal to minus sin f of x and again take the derivative of function which is f of x now look at the question find the derivative of y is equal to tan tangent x minus 2 sin x differentiating with respect to x so dy by dx is equal to d by dx and to tan tangent x minus 2 sin x we can write dy by dx is equal to tan d by dx and to tan tangent x minus 2 d by dx and to sin x now taking the derivative so dy by dx is equal to tan the derivative of tangent x which is equal to secant square x minus 2 as it is and the derivative of sin x which is equal to cos of x next question find the derivative of y is equal to x plus tangent x over 1 plus cosecant x differentiating with respect to x dy by dx is equal to d by dx and to x plus tangent x 1 plus cosecant x here x plus tangent x is the numerator and 1 plus cosecant x is the denominator so according to the quotient rule denominator and then take the derivative of numerator minus numerator and then take the derivative of denominator over denominator whole square so here denominator which is 1 plus cosecant x so d by dx derivative of numerator which is x plus tangent x minus numerator x plus tangent x and then derivative of denominator which is 1 plus cosecant x over denominator whole square 1 plus cosecant whole square so dy by dx is equal to 1 plus cosecant x as it is and the derivative of x which is equal to 1 derivative of tangent x which is equal to secant square x minus x plus tangent x as it is and then derivative of 1 which is constant number is equal to 0 plus derivative of cosecant x which is minus cosecant x cotangent x over 1 plus cosecant whole square now simplifying this result dy by dx is equal to 1 plus secant square x and to 1 plus cosecant x plus minus into minus they will become plus cosecant x cotangent x and to x plus tangent x over 1 plus cosecant x whole square next question find the derivative of y is equal to sin x tangent x to prove this result differentiating with respect to x so dy by dx is equal to d by dx and to sin x tangent x now by using the product rule according to the definition of product rule we can write dy by dx is equal to first function which is sin x and second function which is tangent x so first function and then take the derivative of second plus then second and then take the derivative of first here the first function which is sin of x so sin of x derivative of second which is tangent x plus second function tangent x and the derivative of first function which is sin of x so dy by dx is equal to sin x as it is derivative of tangent which is equal to secant square x plus tangent x as it is and then derivative of sin x which is equal to cos x
Next question, find the derivative of y is equal to 4 cosecant 2x. Differentiating with respect to x, dy by dx is equal to d by dx and to 4 cosecant 2x. So, dy by dx is equal to 4 d by dx cosecant 2x. dy by dx is equal to 4. The derivative of cosecant 2x minus cosecant 2x cotangent 2x then take again the derivative of the function which is 2x. So, d by dx of 2x. Now, dy by dx is equal to minus 4 4 and 2 minus cosecant 2x cotangent 2x. Here the derivative of x which is equal to 1. So, 2 multiplied 1 which is equal to 2. Now, simplifying this result dy by dx is equal to minus 8 cosecant 2x cotangent 2x. Next question, find the derivative of y is equal to 2 cosecant cube 4x. Differentiating with respect to x, dy by dx is equal to 2 d by dx cosecant cube 4x. We can also write in the form of cosecant 4x power 3. Now, according to the power rule, so we can write dy by dx is equal to shift power into coefficient so 2 multiplied 3 and to cosecant 4x and reduce 1 from the power 3 minus 1 which is 2 and again take the derivative of the trigonometric function which is cosecant 4x so d by dx cosecant 4x so dy by dx is equal to 2 multiplied 3 6 cosecant 4x power 2 now the derivative of cosecant 4x which is equal to minus cosecant 4x cotangent 4x now again take the derivative of the function which is 4x. So dy by dx is equal to minus 6 and to cosecant 4x power 2 and to cosecant 4x cotangent 4x the derivative of x which is equal to 1 so 4 multiplied 1 is equal to 4. Now simplifying this result we can write dy by dx is equal to minus 24 cosecant 4x power 3 cotangent 4x.